you know who it is here, Rachel. Rachel Socialized TV, you know. Whatever. So neither. Whatever. I'm at home. And I'm trying to do this video real quick. Because I got to work and like. Oh, I got time. Never mind. It's me. Your girl, I was going to do Love and Hip Hop Atlanta and Basketball Wives LA, but it's now just Basketball Wives Season 6, Episode 1. So that's the one I'm going to do because that one was mm, juicy. Juicy, juicy. And more juicy. Okay. So everybody saw the hype. Ooh, everyone's coming back. She's coming back to Basketball Wives. Like, she made the announcement on the reel back in December, I think, is when it aired. Okay, so that's where we start. We start with Evelyn on the reel. Shawnee showed up. Her and Evelyn were talking. You know, apparently I didn't know that Tammy and Evelyn were not getting along until I started seeing them promotions, promos for this season of basketball. I didn't know they were not getting along, but apparently they're not. And Evelyn didn't want it from the gist of it. Evelyn and Tammy... Don't get along. All because of what happened second season of basketball wise, like Miami. And when you know. So where was I? Shawnee and Evelyn were talking and um they were talking about the whole issue beef between Evelyn and Tammy and Tammy. Evelyn was like, I didn't want to have that stigma of being the side chick or the hoe. But if they were still legally married, then that's what you were. I'm just going to throw that out there. I'm just saying. But, you know, Shawnee want to be the peacemaker. Shawnee want everybody to get along. Shawnee want to be everybody to be there. So, Shawnee's going to have his birthday thing, birthday party for herself. It was 70s theme because she's born in the 70s, apparently. So, yeah, she invited Evelyn, then she went and spoke, Shawnee invited Tammy over to get caught up, and she invited Tammy over and told Tammy Evelyn is in town, and y'all know how Tammy is. She was like, rolled eyes, did this stink face, like, really, bitch, I don't want to see that bitch. But, um, she, and Tammy said her issue with Evelyn was, the an interview she did and that she heard she did and that um she was telling people um that she didn't really fuck with Tammy she didn't want she wouldn't be associated with Tammy she didn't want to be friends with Tammy she didn't want them to be in the same circle and so that was why Tammy was mad so I want Tammy mad about two different things apparently and so Shawnee was mad up with Nick Jones or Johnson or whatever he went with Iggy Azalea his baby mama and um Shawnee met up with her and um yeah this is my personal opinion my motherfucking channel so this is how the fuck I feel about this scene that I seen she said she wasn't a side chick with their second child that she had by Nick um, technically, you are the side, you were the side chick when you got pregnant with your little girl. Because he was with Iggy Azalea, engaged to Iggy Azalea. They were living together. So you, boo boo, were the side chick. Okay? Okay. My personal opinion, you heard it here first. From me. Little of me on my little old YouTube channel. You heard it from me. You were the side chick simple as that you got played it's sad okay it's sad and so then we went with Craig cuckoo crazy jackie and her daughter Shanice, whatever that child's name is she pregnant whatever she asked do you have you spoke to your sister she said yes evelyn jackie mad at evelyn because evelyn donated to jackie's daughter's gofundme account for her son who got badly burned and Jackie felt like Evelyn steps into family, a fair family, my family business, my family. I said, bitch, it was on GoFundMe. It's public. Everybody knew about it. She could have called me and asked. No, she couldn't because y'all don't talk. 
you try to put this front on that y'all talk, but your daughter has said y'all don't. Clearly, you don't, because I remember back in uh, or later season, like season two, season three, when they her dog that the that daughter, the other daughter were there, and Ch Shanice or Sh whatever Shawnee said that my mom always put tennis to get each other. Like I was the pretty light skinned and she was the dark skinned child. To me, that's what it looks like. You disown the child that doesn't look like you, that's not light-skinned. Whatever, Jackie, you not light-skinned either, honey. That's how I feel. So you can't be mad at everyone for donating. There's other people that donated to your daughter. I'm pretty sure there's other celebrities or reality stars that donated to your child because clearly you wasn't going to help. You didn't even have to help. You could have flew out to wherever your child lives and be there for your child and your grandchild, but you didn't. So that's bullshit for me to be mad at Evelyn for that shit. So Jackie was like, I'm going to talk to Evelyn. I'm like, well, okay, go ahead. I don't know how far that's going to go, but. So we're going to mm, skip to skip the barn. And we're going to get to this party, 70s party. And, you know, everybody was decked out in their 70s gear. And, and you know, Jackie showed up as a pimp, which doesn't really surprise me none. Bitch is crazy. So, of course, she's going to dress as something out the, off the ball, off the dome, off the ball. Crazy. So, you know, everybody showed up. Everybody was there. Tammy was there. Jackie, Shawnee, the Kiana girl showed up. She's still, she's still, she mad. That just, mm, we're not going to go there. You was a side chick. Simple as that. Play blank period. And then everybody was waiting on Evelyn to show. Evelyn made her grand entrance and said, hey, the Shawnee got to Tammy. I was like, hey. And Tammy was like, no. Oh, so no hug? Tammy, bitch, no. No hug. What, what, you, what you think this is? She was like, okay. If, well, the shade starts early, I guess. Like, what, what, what? Bitch, really. Tammy's like, you did the interview saying you don't like me, you don't want to be friends with me, so don't come try to hug me. Thank you, clearly. Don't. I just, I, that, mm. yeah, yeah, mm. that's fake. Everyone's like, no, that's, cla I'm just trying to be classy. You can say, like, you can say, you can be classy and say, hey, you ain't got to be fake and try to hug me. Be you said you didn't like me, so why you going to try to come hug me? Like, really? No. So, you know, right off the bat, Jackie. I, I, I don't think Jackie done had too many drinks. But then, because uh, she uh, started right off the bat. She started right off the bat. Gate and when they walked in, was like, I feel like you got into my family business. And everyone was like, what? Bitch, really? I, I help. Everyone's like, I help when I can. I help anybody out that needs help. It just happened. I'm like, it just happened to be your daughter who she helped. That's not stepping into the business. And everyone was like, I did it from the kindness of my heart. If she could call you, but could she really call you up? Because clearly, if she could, she would have. But she didn't. So something there doesn't seem right. I'm like, really, Jackie? You started right off the bat. Jackie's like, well... I just wanted to know if you did it out of spite and was talking junk about me after you did it. And it was like, no, I did it out the kindness of my heart. Then I, I ain't say nothing else bad about you. I helped. Jack was like, well, you could have helped somebody else. Like, damn, you didn't want to help your child? Your ass ain't helping her. What? Your grandson got burned bad. Your daughter need to help with medical expenses. Somebody, more than, I'm pretty sure there's more than other people that helped besides Evelyn that were famous. I'm very sure of that. And then, you know, Jackie got what she had to say. She's like, well, and Evelyn explained, I did have the kindness of my heart because I felt bad. She needed help and I wanted to help. Clear that's all simple as that. Then they had nothing to do with your being a mother or nothing like that. Bad mother, because that's what, that's what that is. I was like, I've been, Jackie's like, I've been taking care for 27 years. Mm, okay, if you say so. 
your daughter saying a different story and from what we've seen in the past. Because ain't no daughter gonna lie about that. No, I'm the daughter. And my mom would never do me like that anyway. But she wouldn't. So, no. Nobody believes it. That you, yeah, okay. And so, you know, Jackie, so she had to say Jackie left because she had to catch a flight. Whatever, bye. She's probably going to be a Doug's ass. Because we all know she, she up a Doug's ass. And then, so, you know, the showdown between Evelyn and Danny. I was like, oh, this conversation going to be juicy. And Because so, Evelyn was like, Tammy looking at me like she want to kill me. She had that bitch want to kill you face. Like, I'm just going to stare your ass down. Like, like oh, okay. Um, yeah. This is awkward. Shawnee's in the middle like, this is awkward. And so, you know, I guess Shawnee started the conversation and was like, told Angela that she told Tammy that you, there were some things that you wanted to get off your chest. And so, here's the opportunity to get off your chest and say what you guys said. Okay, so she said, I didn't want to be known as the hoe because I slept with Kenny. Y'all weren't married or we didn't know he was married. Clearly you did because she made the comment. You, Tammy, you filed for Redorce in 98. So that that happened. I slept with him after the fact. So clearly you just openly knew that you knew the man was married. From my understanding, when you file for divorce, it takes a minute. For, especially in NBA cases, because if there was no prenup, I'm going for half. I'm pretty sure Tammy went for half of everything he got. And so... Tammy was like, no, I didn't divorce him in 98, 1998. Uh, it was like, so when did you divorce him then? Why are you trying to, Tammy was like, so you're trying to make it seem like you're not a hoe because you want to know when I divorced him. What year I divorced him, it doesn't matter. I'm not even, she, Tammy was like, I'm not even mad about that. I don't even care about that. I'm mad at the fact that you said I was a non-motherfucking factor in my marriage because they were still legally married. And everyone was like, but you are. But you knew he was married, clearly. But, you know, whatever. And so they went back and forth. Tammy said, I'm not mad about that. I don't care about that. I don't care about the interview that you did. And I just want an apology. That's it. Everyone walked off now. Got up, walked off. And so then, Tammy and Johnny met up and Tammy found the interview. But she didn't interview because everyone said she didn't do an interview, but she did. And then, um... Tammy was like, you trying to make it seem like you didn't just fuck your way through three different uh, associations. Technically, she's been six years. Technically, she did. She went from the NFL, no, NBA, NFL, then MLB. In six years. Damn. But that's my take on this season episode of Basketball of LA, well, Basketball Lives, season six, episode one. Hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share, and hit that little bell beside the subscribe button when you hit that subscribe button to know when I put when I put more videos up because I'm putting more up real quick real soon so I'll see you guys later bye